Yeah. That, was that, was, that was his fucking own choice. Weakness yeah. and hubris. Yeah, yeah, you tell him, Daniel. How hard is it not to sleep with someone? It's really, really easy. Apparently more difficult than it seems for a lot of people. <laughs> it's really, really easy. It's I don't want to be horny anymore. I just want to be happy. I'm going to cut my balls off. Bro, my balls was my off. Balls was off. <laughs> so I cut them off. <laughs> yeah, my, ba my balls was my off. My balls was off. <laughs> <laughs> Why didn't you sleep with that woman? My balls was, balls was off. This is a fucking switch. <laughs> That'd be great. Can you imagine? Just, just turn it on, turn it back off. Just take it off, put it back on. Okay, if you had the power to be able to turn it off and turn it back on, right? But turn off my turn horniness? It... Yeah, yeah, yeah. But listen, listen. But if you right. turned it on for even a split second, it would just build up. Like all, all... it just it continues to build up. Right? Oh my god! Until you up turn... until, yeah. So <laughs> when you turn it on, <laughs> you're like, oh, oh man, god. I got. It. Stick it in anything I see. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Any amount of holes. I don't care. Would you want that? Would you want that? Or Ew. like, would it just be too much? Uh, I think that'd be a cool power to have because I've then... got enough self control right now, so I don't think I'm. Okay. Yeah, I'm good. I yeah. I think I'll, I don't want uh, the blue I'll ball pass. switch. I'll pass. Mm -hmm. I'll pass. God. Yeah, oh my god, that'd be fucking painful too. How quickly would it would it work though? Yeah. What do you mean quickly? How quickly would how, it work? How quickly would it build? Like, build up? I guess yeah. depending on what your average level of horniness is, and then <laughs> multiply that by however many days that happens. And then whenever you turn it on from that point in time. I haven't devised the horniness algorithm yet, Cody. I don't know. Okay. Really <laughs> okay. Makes sense. I can try and help you with that, Leo. Thank you. Thank That's what I'm being trained be, to do. True, 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 true. This could be your doctored research paper right here. All right, <laughs> this is what this is what you've been building through this whole time, devising the horniness algorithm. See, y'all talking about now, horniness. Now, is level of horniness true? Is that intrinsic to your DNA, like your genetics? Ooh, that's getting <laughs> too philosophical. That we have to find out. Whoa, whoa, like, are whoa, whoa, you whoa. born with a specific level, like a number that we can quantify? How and the fuck then... did we get to this conversation? <laughs> Like Drew and I are problem. doing important research right now, okay? We'd have to have a really, like, big sample, too. I'm sure we have some really different results. On average. Hey, I, I'm willing to me? give you anything you need. Alright, Daniel can be <laughs> one. Daniel. Sample I sample. will also uh, submit myself. Y'all some niggas, like... Fuck it, <laughs> no. What, what else? does that even mean? I'm what not doing that. that. In <laughs> relation to this, in relation to this, what does that have to do with anything? Some nasty-ass niggas, like... Just because we Justin, are not going to masturbate you not for a know what you are in the we horny push, school? Justin, we want to push the limits of science Justin. and what people can think about the sexual doctrine that we've been in, bestowed yeah. upon ourselves. Yeah. Well, literally, literally last year, Justin would be partaking in this conversation. I don't know what he's talking about. That's true. That is true. A year ago, Justin, we'd be on average, how many times a week are you horny? <laughs> and how intense would you say that horniness is? I'm constantly horny. How many times do you actually act yeah, upon That's my secret. I'm always Act upon my horniness a week? Yeah. I agree with Daniel. Yeah. Uh, uh, constant level. I mean, there's like a constant level of horniness. Everyone has a but... base rate that is Yeah, you have uh, a yeah, 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 yeah. You know, it's like, so like, think about it like this. Man, it's like a, this like a sound wave on a graph. You ever seen like a sine wave? You know how like I am. the baseline, right? There's the baseline and then every now and again it'll go up and down. Okay, that's how it works. Yeah. All right, you never go below that certain base. All right, unless your balls was off, okay? And that in that case, <laughs> you would be below that rate, and you would have zero level of horniness. Unless your balls was off. There's there's different factors that will increase our horniness. Exactly. Like you, if we genetics. see like a dead animal on the street. <laughs> what the fuck? That's gonna lower my horniness. But if I, I see a little. I thought you were gonna say, say it like yeah, brings your horniness up. I was about to say, uh. Bro? <laughs> that, that's something else we, we all have the same thought. Yeah, is that, that's, that's something else we have to 
study is what is it that makes people that mean, makes us you know? mean. and and is that quantifiable like seeing like like a nice ass for example like can, by looking at that ass, can we take that ass as a sample, right, and then quantify how much horny that would put into someone, like any given person? You know what I'm saying? Wow. Okay, There's so, so hypothetically, this... like hypothetically, let's say that my base horny level is a two, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, always... okay. What's the scale though? Like, what's the maximum number and the minimum? Oh my well, Let's God. say that the maximum. Let's like go the with the base. A... The base rate is like a, a point five. Like let's go with the base. Let's go with a ten point scale, right? And then I, I think I want to expand it a little bit. Let's say a hundred. Well, let's, let's say 100. I'm saying I want to say have ten. Let's say ten, but each level increases like earthquakes. So each level is ten times more. Like magnitudes of horniness. Yes. Whoa. <laughs> oh, so it's like an exponential. When you're, when you're is this like the fucking Richter quaking. scale for That's fucking <laughs> horniness? So yeah. the the uh, the the level of okay, getting so we're gonna, ten so we're gonna, is impossible. So we're gonna, Okay, so the way we're gonna measure horniness is on magnitude scale. Oh my god. <laughs> like, bro, right now, bro, I'm at a 7.5, bro, I'm telling you what. <laughs> so I'm guessing like, earthquakes are when you are fucking- My horniness could bro. take down a big building. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's say, so like, on base average, I'm at a 1, right? A, a, a just, you know, regular. And then okay. I see- I see a girl walk by at work. I'm I'm depressed at work and I don't want to be there, so I'm at like a point five. I see a girl walk by and I'm like, she's attractive, and I raise to a one for two minutes. <laughs> okay. for and two I go minutes. back down. So there's a, a time 5. limit. Okay. Oh, so like, no. You have to, you have to, no, yeah. there's no time. It's there like is a time. Okay. You don't it's stay like horny. So let's think about this. Like, okay, so on the graph, right when this would be being drawn out. The, the horniness would be first a jump, like a jagged line going straight up, and yes. then eventually a curve down. Right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> so we have really? an, so like a sine wave. So we have an idea. No, of, uh, what no, that doesn't mean since there are jumps, but there is a, a increase because your body would continually produce like testosterone. So you're saying become... that it's it's uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Drew, help me. Exponential. So eventually it just build up and build and build and build until yes. you were to release your horniness and then mm -hmm, mm -hmm, it would but would it immediately fall or would it just like on a slow No 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 down? it immediately falls. Yeah, it immediately okay, once so you're done on clarity. Once you're you done you feel disgusted. Negatives. You go into okay. the negatives, dude. You're like, yeah. why the fuck did I so, like that? So the post nut clarity algorithm is the like, post nut <laughs> clarity <laughs> algorithm. <laughs> it's a post nut. The post nut clarity theory post is the night idea that clarity <laughs> algorithm. <laughs> what <laughs> the fuck is happening here? That's the lowest point in you ever reached. What yeah. the fuck is yeah. happening? Here? <laughs> <laughs> That's when you go below your base value. Is the post clarity theory the idea that as soon as you finish the morning, you oh, immediately no. deep depression in which you you think about what did I just do, and so your base morning just will then fall below what it normally is. This and nigga has made a fucking term, PNCA, the post nut clarity no, algorithm. It's not, it's not an algorithm. It's a theory. Justin. It's a theory. Oh, oh, I'm yeah. sorry. Let me add a fucking T then. PNCT. <laughs> Has yet to be proven. So but let's say let's say my true. base horny level is one, right? And then and then throughout the week of of like let's let's say that it's Aaron's like period week, so I can't do anything. So it starts raising exponentially to like a a five, right? Oh. And then and now and now we're on day five. Okay. Or day seven, so the period is ending. <laughs> and then, so we're at an eight magnitude right now. We're we're at like a <laughs> magnitude like, of eight in the horniness. We're scale. like a seven or an eight. I'm like I have to do this or I'm going to fucking kill myself. No 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 no. That's that's a ten. A ten is like you're willing to risk your life. But I thought we said you can't happen. get to a ten. It's just like you can get to like nine point nine 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 nine. So we're, nine, we're, like... we're saying that ten is unreachable. That it yes. is impossible to reach a level. If 10 you reach a ten, you are literally yeah. going to fuck yourself to death. The equation diverges at ten, where it just like it's constantly approaching what infinity. About it never stories, reaches though, of ten. People who masturbate themselves to death, where they have heart attacks. Okay, they're a ten. They, okay, they're yeah. A 10. Can we say that like a ten, a 10 means death? Like ten is just death at that if point. You, if you are you're 10, willing to risk your life okay, in order fair to enough. leave yourself alone. If you're at 10, you are either a succubus, 
Or... Or dead. Or dead. Okay. <laughs> or dead. <laughs> <laughs> and then cause of death, <laughs> level 10 magnitude of this. <laughs> On the P and C A scale. <laughs> yeah. Post nut clarity so then algorithm. The post nut clarity theory did not prove <laughs> here, as nutted the. <laughs> We're at like an 8, right? Okay. And then. I'm like. It has to happen today, Aaron. It's either today, or I do it myself and you, you, you fuck off. And then it happens. The nut. <laughs> and Why then... did you describe okay, it like that? What this the is fuck? another thing. Do we the attribute post nut clarity to sex or just it ha no, 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 no. It happens for both. Oh my god. Why? You regret yeah. having sex with your girlfriend? No, 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 no. Not that. Not that. We, okay, having sex and masturbating are two different things. So, really? It, right. Yes. And oh, so yeah. If you have sex, um,. The post nut clarity isn't nearly as big. It's significantly mm -hmm. lower. Um, but you feel so disgusted regardless. For like 30 seconds. But if you masturbate, <laughs> you feel disgusted for like 3 minutes. Huh. So, let's, let's say, let's say, hypothetically for the sake of the argument, um, I had sex with Aaron. And then for 30 seconds, I'm like, I'm like, wow, that was awful. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, dude. And then, and then I'm like, I go back to playing, uh, whatever I was playing, and then I'm like, cool. And now, now because I just had sex for the you next, just nutted in me and went back for to the next, the yeah, for the, the next, like, four was still on. <laughs> for the what? next six hours, the base horny is now at point five to point, point three to point five. It's below so normal. It, so it remains, yeah. So this, the equivalent of post nut clarity. Yes. I feel like this is a different theory entirely, though. I feel like I think post clarity only applies to when like depression is the reason that. Okay, your, so let's say let's say hypothetically below. that that uh... because if it's just like okay, I'm not horny anymore because I had sex, then that's not the, that's not the equivalent. I feel of the post. All right, let's theory. let's switch it up then. Let's say like it's day six. And she's still on it her is period. two thirty in the fucking morning, and we're discussing the theory of <laughs> horny. Bits. You brought up the we're, theory. Hey, man, we're you said it, not me. Men. Yeah, yeah, we're we're educating ourselves right now. So let's say hypo. She still has one day left, but I'm like, no, it has to happen right now. Uh, so I go on, I go on Reddit, <laughs> and I I just start looking at shit. And I'm like, wow, none of this is good enough. And then I am like, you go on just... Reddit. <laughs> look, why do you go on Reddit? Wait, hang look, on. That was the, look, 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 look. Wait a minute. That was the first thing that came to my mind. Reddit? Mm. Look. Do you write Pog Champ after you finish <laughs> fucking gutting after the picture you saw? Look, the po you go on Our whatever. Gamer girls, you go on, you go on, you go on 4chan, you go on fucking 4chan? Reddit. <laughs> I am terrified to think of what is posted as porn on 4chan. You go on oh Pornhub, you go on Xmaster. Whatever, doesn't matter. The point is, porn you porn look chain, for porn stuff. Chain. But porn the problem chain. is, with Pornhub, you look for videos and you're like, that's not good enough. <laughs> I don't care about that part. I you're like, I gotta find something that's like, offensive. Offensive? Is like, this another I, theory we're developing right now? I think we're going, going too deep this down is small rabbit potatoes. hole. We need to focus on the bigger picture. Look, the point is what I'm getting to. So, like, let's say you watch a video that is uh, taboo or okay, uh, such as what? Disgusting. What relates? What is? What is this kind of? Uh, step brother, step sister. Is that taboo nowadays? I hear that's very no, popular. No, it's very it is popular. Very popular. Um, uh, I mean, I wouldn't know. <laughs> uh, uh, someone and then having sex I feel with like them. that's standard though. I like um we don't need see. specifics about what's taboo. Move on please, the Cody. Get is, to the let's, point. Let's go with it's taboo and you wouldn't want to tell your friends. Yeah. Okay. So you watch it and then you 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 nut to it and then the moment the first bit of semen comes out you're like wow that's fucking disgusting i and you immediately like turn your phone off and you like close the browser and you're like i, I don't even want to look at myself right now and then you go and you sit down and you're like you just sit there for a second and you're like 
That didn't even feel good. Why did I do that? Okay, and now you're at a point one. You're at a point one on the what? on the horny scale, and you sit there for about three minutes. And then you see a normal looking girl that's attractive, and you're like, alright, cool, back to one. Quick question. Can you ever reach a zero on the horny scale? Uh, yes. Yeah, um. When death. your balls are off. Yeah, my balls was off. <laughs> Castration through how you reach zero on the scale. With yeah. your balls there are two off. ways. There are two ways to reach zero on the horny scale through. And it's either immediately following a ten, um, in which you have died, or, uh, castration. Okay. Wait. So when you die from nutting, you go up to a ten, then down to a zero. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You reach. Okay. So have you guys ever seen uh, Naruto Shippuden? You know when guy, Shippuden? when my guy, yeah, when he opens up the eighth gate. Yeah. Oh, right. God, yeah, yeah. And he, he he becomes so powerful, and he only gets that like two minutes of power, and then he fucking dies because it, it tore him apart. That's what happens, Drew. You reach that ten for. One minute, and then you see the light on the other side. Although, let's be honest, you're probably gonna go to hell if you masturbated so goddamn hard <laughs> that you died. You probably you know, there's probably no redeeming. Oh uh, uh, no, man! Oh, bro, I can just imagine. I can just imagine hearing that on the fucking news. Somebody died from masturbation. So it I'm pretty sure it's happened before. Big. Yeah, it yeah. happened more often. Oh than my big. god! This is uh. It's been pretty good research discussion. I'll go ask so my professor in his office about it. Yeah. Bro, bro, you go uh, on to be it. honest, in terms of like actual statistical stuff, there would be like an interesting question here of in statistics there's something called it actually yeah again goes back to earthquake. It's called the Poisson distribution. Where it's like A pussy uh, Shut what? up. <laughs> Go to bed. Justin, just kick Justin, Justin out of the party. Just, Justin, just ruined we're it. intellectuals. Okay? <laughs> we are educators and innovators of this newfound uh, theory. Alright, Drew, please continue. I'm sorry. Thank I'm you. Really Thank I'm you. so sorry. How could I? No worries. Uh, like me to happen. Like, the Poisson distribution is used to model, like, earthquakes and, like, during World War II, it's like bombing runs, like, how often it would happen, like, what the air bowl would be in between on average. And I'm thinking about that in terms of, like, acting upon horniness. Like, is there a Poisson distribution where there's, like, a set amount of time where once you... It, well, another interesting thing with Poisson, though, is that the probability doesn't change based on how long it's been since you've mastered it. So maybe it wouldn't be the case. It's always, like, the same probability that you'll do it. But maybe that will work masturbating. You'll masturbate at random intervals. Mm -hmm. You know what? Also, let's say is like, also is religion a factor in this theory? Of <laughs> uh, <laughs> yes, if it <laughs> like, includes you, you don't do it. I'm gonna because, go with because no. It, if if you're Catholic, you're not supposed to do it. So then... I guess I guess I, yeah. I guess it doesn't alter the amount of horniness you are. Basically, just the, the you just can't do it. In a you just can't do anything yeah. about it. Leo, have okay. you ever had a boner killed by Catholicism where you think like I shouldn't be doing this or like I? God, yeah, it sometimes. Uh, on me. Well, sometimes Drew, when that happens, I just think about the Crusades and just pop right back up. You know, I'm ready to break. Right, I can <laughs> just get right back into it. <laughs> Wow. wow. I'm going to bed. Let's say, <laughs> hypothetically, for the sake of the argument. Oh my Shut God. the fuck up. You know what? Let's get Ben Shapiro on this. I want to hear his take. Let's say, hypothetically, for the, for the sake of the argument. And then he talks I... really fast for two minutes, and then let's, we're like, thank you, Ben. Let's say, hypothetically, for the sake of the argument, I, uh, I had sex with my wife. I had sex with my wife, and hypothetically, she had a wet-ass pussy. So, hypothetically, I, I had sex with my wife. And my 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 horny level before I, had, before I had sex with my wife was hypothetically around an eight or a nine magnitude. It was really high. I was you know. And then uh, hypothetically, I I come and uh, I come in my wife on accident and now I'm scared. Because, no, I don't I don't, don't want to be. So hypothetically, let's say I'm scared. Let's say let's say so let's say fear, <laughs> does fear play a factor in this? Let's say, let's, let's, yeah, let's if you're scared, now your horniness is going all the way down. I, I, no, I'm, I, but not down to zero. Like, what if it goes uh, all the way down? No, not down to zero. Maybe like a one. What if Some people? Oh my god! Translates. We're gonna have to take in account of uh, um like mental um, diseases. No, not mental diseases. Like uh, fetishes. Uh, fetishes, yes. Oh, 
What were people oh, like God. into like that pain or fear? Into or pain. Some people think pain yeah. is like, bad, so like their horniness will go down. Oh like most people, God. when their life is in danger, their horniness will fall. But if you're like that's, into that's like the same you know, mm -hmm. then th th this is Hey, thanks for volunteering, guys, so we can make sure we know your preferences and then check and see how that plays out. <laughs> Daniel, what are you into? What's your what's your secret kink? No one knows about. Um, poop. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't funny. Why did I laugh at that? I no. fucking hate it. was the delivery. This it was conversation. Delivery. So much. Justin, what's your secret kink? No, fuck you. Justin, you're part of the sample group. We need. This yeah, you time. volunteer. You have to tell him. No, I fucking didn't. I was the one motherfucker who didn't volunteer. All right, all right, you said Cody, you volunteer. No, I didn't. You're it was you and fucking Cody. <laughs> I volunteered wow. for shit. I called y'all niggas for fucking volunteering. Wow. Wow. Cody. He said the N word. Cody. Yes. What? What is your? What is your secret kink? That we can apply to this. <laughs> so you, you like women of the He likes niggas. He likes, he likes, bro, he really like chaining them up and putting them in the hot box. It just gets wow. like fucking oh off. Come on, right <laughs> wow. there. Justin, it is 2020. You I said don't... the N word three times since we went to this party. I don't and then give you're a fuck. About slavery. Okay, and the hot and... box, bro. I just watched, and the hot I box. just watched Django and watched. A poor woman get dragged out of the hot box. What's naked. her name, like, Cody? What's her fucking name? I don't name? fucking remember. I, it, 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 <laughs> I watched it with Alex and uh, Edwin and. Did Alex Matthew. laugh and say "haha"? I or... bet he did. I probably yeah. yes, 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 he did a couple times. Oh man! Did he actually say the N word? Justin. I'm yes. Kidding. No, I'm just asking. Him. No, no, no. Hard R. Man has no shame. Oh, oh. Uh, hard, hard R's so, around. Oh, don't worry. I'll, I'll bleep every. When I, when I have this recorded, I'll just bleep every image that I said. Like, I'll make sure you bleep that. One. You're black, Cody. so you're good to go. You're gonna have to bleep the one that Cody said. Oh, okay. yeah. Okay. <laughs> that'll, even, that'll be even funnier. Or if you just... Cody will be canceled. Wait, what if I don't? Oh, what God, if I bleep the ones Cody. that I say, but Cody? Wait, we <laughs> have to do it. We're gonna cancel Cody. Yeah, we're gonna cancel you, Cody. Yeah, we have to you jump on the run. boat real quick. We gotta jump on the boat real quick, or people are gonna cancel us for not canceling Cody. Oh, shit. Yeah. yeah. Right. So sorry, oh. Cody. Cody, if it comes, if it comes down to well, it, if there's a bus to be thrown under, you better believe we're fucking throwing you under it. <laughs>